Hi, Sean Vincent here from the Silver Bow Fly Shop in Spokane, Washington. Welcome to Lake Fishing 101. If you're new to lake tactics, this is a very simple, easy technique for you to learn. We're just going to talk about stripping streamers and some different retrieves. We have three methods we use for stripping streamers in lakes. One is a short, quick little retrieve. The second is a hand twist retrieve. And the third is a long, slow retrieve. Let's take a look at those. The first stripping technique is short, quick strips. Short, quick strips are great for pulling woolly buggers and leeches. They're great for damselfly nymphs. And they're actually good for uh, chronomid fishing and water boatman fishing too, especially in the spring and fall. But the short, quick strips should be short, two to three inch strips, with a little pause in between each set of strips. So strip, 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 pause, strip, 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 pause, strip, 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 pause, just like that. Another great retrieve on a lake is a hand twist retrieve. A hand twist retrieve is a little slower than the quick strips that we just talked about and a little more subtle. So a hand twist retrieve starts off with just pinching the line and then using the rest of your palm to grab another chunk and then you re-grab the line by your stripping finger. So it's a continuous pinch, grab a chunk, and then re-pinch, grab a chunk. This is a great technique for chronomid fishing or anytime you want a really slow, soft retrieve. The third type of retrieve is a long, slow pull. A long, slow strip is a great technique when the water's really cold, or you're stripping streamers and buggers, or even when you're chronomid fishing. In this stripping technique, you want to pull about two feet a line. So it's a long, steady, continuous pull, just like this. Some final thoughts on stripping streamers and lakes. So when the water's colder, you want to go with your slower stripping techniques. When the water's warmer and the fish are more active, you want to speed up your retrieval rate. So don't just get stuck in fishing one speed. If you're not getting results, change. Along with changing our retrieval rate, if you're not getting fish, you should change your depth. And depending on the time of the year, we'll kind of dictate what line you use for that. Early season, you can go with your slow to shallow sinking lines like intermediate or type twos or threes. Water warms up, fish move deeper, then you put on your fast high D type of lines to get down to that 20 to 30 foot range. Alright guys, that wraps up our Lake Fishing Tactics 101 Strip and Streamers. If you have any questions, please let us know in the comment section down below or check out our website silverbowflyshop.com. Thanks.